Hi, and uh, welcome back to Let's Play Tribe Princess. <coughs> and yeah, that's the boss door. Ah, yeah, yeah it's fairy. Alright, down we go. Yeah, you'll need Zora Tunic, Iron Boots, and Claw Shot for this fight. And maybe something else? I don't know. That's your thing. Look, the only thing we can do is dive down and have a look around. So we can do it. Okay. Okay. <sighs> okay, talk to now. <laughs> yeah, and I'm recording. Anyway, down, down, down we go. La 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 la. La 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 la. Here we go. The true challenge to this boss is doing it without the Zora armor. <laughs> Which I think is impossible. You can't actually enter this cutscene without putting the boots on, but. Yeah. More fuel! Yeah, it's the guy from Ocarina of Time, but more powerful, or supposed to be. Well, he's evolved at least. Right, you. Ah, but. It's pretty much the same as the Ocarina one, just grapple him out and then beat the crap out of him. For the first form, anyway. And yes, there's more than one form. Shut up, Midnight, I know what I'm doing. Yeah, you don't have to be on the ground as well. You can try and grapple him from the water. But the trouble is, you can't attack him, which is why it's recommended you do it from the ground. <laughs> well, I've got one hit. That's great. Oh, he releases them water bomb things as well. But yeah. It's a good idea to get a spin attack on him because it's quick. Oh, when you hit those guys, get back because they will go off. <laughs> They're annoying as well because you lock onto them all the time. Yeah. Just set them off, really. Hope they hit each other. Oh, but oh yeah, you can pick them with the thing and just throw them. I'm not sure if they have an effect on more feel like that guy before when we threw bombs in his head. Ah, oh, come on, I can get more money. Oh, what happened? <laughs> what is that? What happens when you get three hits? Wow, that was fast. Oh boy, sure it wasn't going to be that easy. I can see its weakness. If only briefly. Right now, you don't want the iron boots. <laughs> yeah. Just lock onto it and keep swimming at it. Oh, you just get out. Right, you need to grapple the eye when you've got a chance. Best tactic is to get a little bit above it and go where it's headed. There we go. Now just swing like mad. Swing like a madman. Right, and then just do it again. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty easy this fight. Yeah, just keep firing until you get it. Too far away. Swing closer. Damn it. I will get you. Ah. I'm going to take the lock off and just swim manually. Here we go. When finish flashes up, press A to finish him. You get about four hits each time. I think you swim faster when you're not locked on, I'm not sure. No, that's just... Yeah. But yeah. For the finish! <laughs> yeah! <coughs> Ride the sea world.
question is, if this temple is under a lake, where's the water draining to and why isn't the lake water draining in? Oh well, it's a game, it doesn't have to make sense. Either that or it's a draining chamber. Alright, anyway, our final few shadow. I'm hoping we've got enough time for the cutscene afterwards. If not, I'm gonna cut after this little speech. There it is, the last few shadow. I'll just take that, thanks. Now, don't resent me for all I put you through. I need this thing. Besides, we have to do something about Sam, the one who thinks he's the king of shadows. His power is a false one. I'll prove it by using these. So, I've done everything I needed to. I'm sorry for dragging you all over the place with me. Yay, we're no longer Midna's slave. So, shall we go? I thought you didn't need me. Oh well. Oh, hi, container. Yay. That's our ninth. If it is our ninth, then I made a mistake in the previous part. <laughs> I think. Oh no, I didn't. Eh. Yeah, I remember that math fail. <laughs> Eleven and three fifths plus two fifths equals nine. <laughs> now the other. Yeah, no. Ah, failing again. Yeah, almost a hundred hours we've racked up. Yay! <laughs> <coughs> yeah, that's purely because I leave it on when I'm not playing. Because it's usually why it's uploading. I leave it halfway through like a dungeon or something, so I don't save and I just leave it on. Huh? Oh crap! <laughs> the light spirit will save me. Ghosts. Snake, alligator, whatever I believe. Well, that was disappointing. Oh, come on, I already fixed this spring. I'd like to wake up now. Oh. <laughs> Did you honestly mean to take an ancient and withered power like this and turn it against me? You are a foolish traitor, Midna. Why do you defy your king? A king, you do nothing but abuse the magic of your tribe? You must be joking. How dare you? Are you implying that my power is our old magic? Now that is a joke. This power is granted to me by my god. It is the magic of the king of the twilight and you will respect it. Go me! Ow. My Midna, did you forget? That beast is one of the light dwellers who oppressed our people. No matter how much you may desire otherwise, he will never be more than a shadow in their world. You cannot consort with their kind. But if we can make their world ours, Midna, light and darkness will meet at last. Our tribe will take back their realm and sweet darkness will blot out this harsh light. And that Midna is why. I need you. Not just for me, but for all of our people. Lend me your power. So be it. I will turn you to the light world you cover. Cover. Whatever. Yeah. Not sure how you pronounce that word. Light meets twilight. This can't be good.
Uh oh. Bye. Where the hell am I? As they dump me in a field. Well, I'm running out of time, so we'll continue this cutscene next part. Let's find out where we are and what we've got to do. So see you there.